Hello, I'm Jerry Rigged, and this is the Dusker's Daily Challenge for April 15th, 2018. If it wasn't until Sunday, and you're an American, your taxes would be due. Apparently they're due Tuesday or something, I don't know. I already finished mine. Stupid, stupid taxes. Today, or yesterday rather, 21 players with Smith taking away the top score of a 760. Peak scored a 750, Ash White and GRZ a 740, and then Mustika 21, Quietus 1 1, Fax Tolgja, myself scored a 730, Dargard a 720, and Dano 416 a 710. Continuing from there, we have LB and Decavoid in 11th and 12th with the 710, and Marvin in 19th with the 650. So, looks like it was a fairly generous uh, or forgiving ship yesterday with a 650 on Marvin. Still being a very positive score. I was going to say something else, but now I forget because I had to yawn. Today we have Sensor and Overload. Was yesterday just a slime ship? Yesterday was just a slime ship, I think. That's what I was saying to say. Uh, today we have Sensor, Overload, and slightly below average drone health. Three infestations on a barge A. Let's go ahead and get the sensor down in here. You know, I always put it in the back, but just because sentries have certain behaviors, I wonder if I might want to put it not in the back so that sentries don't come back here to attack it. Let's go ahead and get started. Get a sensor down here. Big room. have a drone right there that I can already see. And a decent portion of the ship is already visible. Unfortunately, that's that, there's that one room right here in the center. I know it starts with nothing in it, but... Um, I already hear Swarm. I hear lots of Swarm. I might want to open D11. Lots of scrap to start with. I definitely want to start trying to get that drone, see what it has on it. I'm not in such a pushed position that I have to, uh, <clears throat> that I have to check A3 already. And because I'm in such a terrible position as far as... I don't like this, but... Very close. Very close. Has a pry. Well, that's not really very useful, is it? Now, I did see a terminal in there, but what I'm really concerned about is whether or not there's a vent. Because I did not look closely enough to see whether or not there are vents. There's not. Now, I'm hoping for survey... Ship scan, not in that order. You know what? I'm okay with that. Very okay with that. Defenses were deactivated. This now gives me a means to clear the rest of the ship. can't check that. I 
I didn't hear anything that time, but I could have been hearing the swarm from R5 when I was near D25, or I could have been hearing a swarm moving around. Now again, we know there's three infestations, and we only know of one so far. They have poor hull integrity as well, so... I need to act fast, or faster. Um... Alright, there is slime in this room. Lots of it. While I'm here, I'm gonna use... Drone 3 as a scout drone for... Uh, can I see what room that was? No, I can't. Time. Not nearly as good as I'd like, especially knowing that door is being attacked. And I have no way to deal with it. I knew I couldn't do anything about that. If they go into R5, though, I'm good. Okay. Um. That's not good. Although, I guess the standing question is, does it matter? <sighs> See if I can figure out the last infestation. And if A3 fails, so what?
All right. So I'm kind of screwed here. I'm not going to have any way to really... If R4 is safe, then I can use it. Oh, okay. All right, so I can... Son of a bitch. I mean, maybe. No, I waited too long. Son of a bitch. Um, that leaves me in a position I do not want to be in at all. I'm just going to let A3 fail. Because it, it really serves me no purpose right now. No, I'm not. Great. So... Sacrificial probe time. Okay, well that's actually very good. Did I not? Why did I not? So that must have been, that could have been in a room that I don't know about yet, because, uh, as has been told... If you aren't... Seriously? Like you're being 100% serious right now. What else can I do here? I can I can hear swarm from R9, so I'm not opening D14.
I could overload R8. I could do that. I don't need a defense on that circuit. Overload is not my favorite, by far. Or not. Um, this is going to take a lot more time now, because I'm trying to work around the Corrupted Clothes. The good news is, if there's a vent anywhere, it's not in the rooms that I can see, so, yeah. Progressing, though, is going to be a real challenge. What I want to do is get drone 1 and 2 on the ship, 1 and 3 on the ship, at 16, sec 16 minutes. And that way... Or very close. That way I can open D23 and see if anything moves in there. I still don't know the other infestation. A3 is going to start failing right away. Not as close as I would have liked it, but okay. I can, once I'm reasonably confident on this, I'm gonna wait till let's say 1510, that'll be 45 seconds. Really, I'm waiting for the uh, the probe to move around. All right, if there's something in there right now, it doesn't matter. I mean, there's nothing in there right now. If there's, yeah. <clears throat> Same room? Okay, that's actually really good. There is a vent, but it's probable that I killed everything. Now the downside is there's a generator, which means I have no safe way 
of maneuvering. Well, the maximum possible time for that vent is 22 minutes and 50 seconds, I believe. So I can think about how suicidal I want to be. Because aside from waiting for 22 minutes and 30 seconds, I may have said 50 seconds, uh, 22 minutes and 30 seconds, aside from waiting for that, I can't think of any other... Yeah. Damn. The problem is there are no more airlocks. So, room 8 has a 19% chance of being hit in 4 minutes. I didn't think about that. Upgrade I have doesn't matter as long as it's not the well Moment of truth. Should be safe now. One minute, R8, 20% chance to be hit. I want that one scrap, even if I can't get anything else on the ship. I'm on A1.
that works. We have one to three. Oh, well, you know, our three's not in a room, so, hmm. I've got plenty of time. jumped it along. <laughs> I was expecting it was going to reset it like that, and it, it jumped it toward... Alright. Oh, asteroids photo collect. Good. I'd rather stay away from R9 just to not provoke the... Uh... This seems like a terrible, terrible idea. <sighs> Let's go ahead and pick up the probe. It's not really going to do me any good. I just want to see what size of ship is left. Oh, God! Well, that is unfortunate, but okay. Wasn't watching the time. Alright, I... Maybe I can do something here. At this point, I am facing extremely diminishing returns. I'm going to open D8 because it's the safest way to get out. I'm putting the interface and probe back on 3. See if we're dealing with anything in 11 and 12. It's possible they're not, they're empty. It's possible. Nope. Sentry. And I can't clear R6 now. Damn it. the slime spawn. How bad is it?
It's, no, it's already, doesn't matter. All right, well, little sacrificial probe. If I'd only been paying a little bit better attention to the time, I could possibly have dealt with this sentry. But, just not gonna happen. And as a result, I'm going to, I'm not going to wait for the whole thing, but I'm just going to let this entire ship, or most of it at least, just blow out into space. Beyond that, I could overload. I could overload. Unfortunately, the slime is too progressed. But... But that means maybe another probe would be alright. Maybe. How desperate am I, is the question. I don't want to open A2 because I don't know if something else could be roaming. Interesting. Oh, right. Probe doesn't rescan a room that has been scanned. So, unfortunately, because R7... Oh, no, I cleared R7. Didn't I? Maybe? Damn it. Where is it? All right, well, that is what that is then. I'd still like to see what's in those rooms, though. One hidden scrap. And a defense. That kinda sucks. Alright. Alright, the probe is going to be lost. Two sacrificial probes. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. That's kind of being mean to the probe, but...
What what room is oh generator in R9 was vented, probe lost. Two probes lost oh the other destroyed one was lost. Alright. Alright, that is going to be it then. Alright. Big party. Total of 840. I think only one scrap from that sentry. Two, one hidden scrap that I couldn't get. You know, now that I think about it, I could have put... Well, I didn't know that it was a sentry. I, it could have been a leaper. Which would have made a big difference. Alright. Close commands failing sucks. 12 scrap. Could have had 13. Probably still more than that. One propulsion fuel. Starting score of 510. And one drone with two upgrades, which probe I always love. The pry, not so useful, especially when close fails. And so far, I didn't take any damage, but Decavoid did manage to get an 850. Could be drone health, could be other things. LB didn't get the fuel, but did have a higher score. Or maybe something else happened there. Deno416 and I scored an 840, Lustiga 21, and Smith an 785. Probably not getting the fuel and probably missing out on some other scrap. Innocent, a 780. Big J, a 750. Wait, no. There must be a drone health difference because... Because the numbers just aren't adding up right. Because if... I didn't get the fuel, then I would have had an 835. And no one... No one has an odd number with a 5. So there must be a drone health difference going on. Um, but we have Big J with a 750, Kobo Commando with a 740, and Fishmonger taking some radiation from some room for a 701, or getting hit with a sentry. So, unpleasant ship today. We also have Fax Told Joe with a 690 and 11th. Uh, unpleasant ship today. Close command failing relatively early. I wish that I hadn't slimed the... Or, yeah, I wish I hadn't slimed the room with the terminal. And I wish that I'd gotten that sentry into the other terminal room. If it had been a leaper, I didn't want it to go the wrong way and trap my drone in a room, basically. So it is what it is. Uh, unpleasant ship, like I said. If you have finished, if you haven't done your run yet, good luck for that very reason. If you have, leave a comment with our experiences and strategies on a ship like this. I spent probably 35 minutes, give or take. It wasn't quite that long for the mission times, a 32, 34, I think. Um, trying to work around a corrupted close command. I did this last time, too. And it makes for super long videos because you have to be extremely cautious. But I didn't really get anything for it. Did you? Were you able to... What? Were you able to herd that sentry where you needed it to go? Were you able to deal with the swarm? Which, if I'd known about the spacing of that room, I definitely could have. I didn't even think about the room being connected uh, with the, uh, the, ter the defense room, which would have made things so much better. If you'd like to check out other videos and some other good playthroughs, which, hey, scored the same or better than me, you can see Marvin, Copper, Dead 416, Darguard, Decavoid. No, that's not it. Marvin, Copper, De Wow, LB, I'm sorry I missed you. Marvin, Copper, Dead 416, LB, Nox, Skitney, Mustika 21, Darguard, Decavoid, and Merkaller. All linked in the video description. Uh, I missed Mustika and Nox as well, so sorry guys. If you enjoyed, 
though it did run long, it was I I think it was a valiant effort, even though it doesn't really have much to show for it. Do please like, and have a good day.